Hi, I'm Chris with Carnival Cruise Addicts, and this is episode 16, Yakety Yak, straight from the yak's mouth. John Heald, Carnival Cruise Line's brand ambassador, posts on his Facebook page, ask me questions, not me, him, and he answers them. We love going over some of the ones that A, we didn't know, B, you might know, C, just to dispel the myths. So in this episode, we're talking about gloves for food. Cruise credits, diapers, yeah. Guy's Burger, fresh or not, Legend Dry Dock, and who's my cruise director? All right, question one. Folks were on the Vista, <clears throat> enjoying the cruise, very much so, went to get a pizza. And notice the crew back there was not wearing gloves Woo! to make pizzas. Why not? These folks themselves actually worked in food service, and wherever they work, they were required to wear gloves. John's response, it is not a requirement of the chefs making pizza. They have a very regimented and detailed washing rule uh, that's in plain view of the guests, there are sinks everywhere, and their supervisors are constantly monitoring what they do. Me personally, I've worked in food service. I don't think the gloves are sanitary at all. I currently, where I work, there's restaurants on both sides of me, and I will see the restaurant people, chefs, outside with their gloves on, having a cigarette, talking on their cell phone, leaning on the wall with their gloves on. Do you think they're changing them when they go back in? I don't. I think they promote worse habits, honestly. Washing your hand is the best. Another guest. They purchased a cruise credit, and they're wondering if for some reason they can't go on their cruise, will they be refunded the cruise credit? <clears throat> and if they do make the cruise, can they use it in the casino? The answer, yes and yes. Absolutely. If you're going to the casino, you can charge your room, and that will go against your onboard credit. Don't ask me how I know that. I know that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> next one. What is the proper protocol for disposing of diapers on the cruise for your room? On one Facebook page, this lady said her uh, room steward said, put them in the little biohazard bag and put them outside your room. She was a little taken aback by that. And John agreed. He said, no, don't do it. No poopy diapers in the hallway. Don't freaking do it. Um, he's literally said, under no circumstances should you leave them in the hallway. Leave them in your room. Your room steward knows where to look for them. They will talk to you about a spot so they know to look for them if you have them. Please do not leave them in the hallway. See triumph in the little poopy situation they had there. Anyway. This one I was actually a little curious on myself. Guy's Burger Joint. Are they frozen patties or are they fresh? John's answer, they're fresh. They are quite literally fresh. They take them out, they boil them up, they put them on the grill, and you eat them deliciously, by the way. Um, but no, they are absolutely not frozen. All the ground beef on there is a 80-20, and it is 100% fresh. That's why they're so good, in my opinion. He didn't say that. I did. Uh, next one. Legend. Will it be going into dry dock next month? Answer, yes. It is scheduled for dry dock on April 27th. So that's when it goes in. He's going to update everybody as the details come out. But yes, it is absolutely scheduled for dry dock. And this is a cool one too. How do I know what the cruise director is on my ship? There's a link. It is... HTTP, no, I'm just kidding. We'll put it in the description below. It's long. Um, but he did say, I wouldn't say take it with a grain of salt, but things change. You know, these are people that have lives as well, so something may happen. They may have to jump ship quite literally and bring in a new CD. So use it as a pretty good guideline, but things change. Don't get on the cruise and go, why are they not here? This said it was supposed to be here. We all have lives. Things change. So just keep an eye on it. And they'll, it's a live document. So as they update it, you get to see it. So again, that was episode 16 of Yakety Yak. Thanks for watching. Have a great night.